I just built this gaming setup for less than $500 and this is how I did it. But the first thing I needed to do was write down a list of things that I needed for the setup so that I don't lose track. All right, now that I'm ready to go, I'll pick up the vlog tomorrow. All right, guys, so we're currently at this pizza spot. This place is honestly so dope. We also have an arcade, which I'm gonna show you guys real quick. Watch this. Not too sure what this game is. I'm oh, you can choose what games. So this is sick. Look, they got Mario Bros here. The Simpsons, what the heck? I'm actually so hyped to try this place out, but once we're done with here, we're gonna head to Micro Center, and hopefully they have the monitor over there, and also Best Buy. So stay tuned. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. Yo, I don't know if it's just me, but I love coming to electronic stores. They got keyboards right here. Look at that, they even got a sim racing setup over there. There's honestly just so much to look at. We're here to pick up the monitor. We're just currently looking for an employee to help us out. So what's this look? Only $99 from Acer. Yo, that's low key a steal. It was on sale, so we managed to pick it up. That's actually not bad of a monitor. Now the only thing is if they have it in stock. Right, guys so this is the console right here the xbox series s i've always played on playstation but never on xbox pretty excited to see how the xbox is going to perform so stay tuned okay so we got the xbox and the monitor i'm just so hyped right now to the sound of the setup so make sure to stay tuned let's get to setting up 1080p, 180Hz, 1 millisecond response time with an IPX panel for $99. That's just honestly wild to me. Yeah, I'm peeling the sticker off. Look how satisfying this is. So I finished unboxing the monitor. And honestly, this monitor is pretty nice. I like how it has like a thin bezel around the monitor. Overall, this monitor is a 10 out of 10. But now we gotta finish setting up, putting it on the stand. Finally about to unbox the Xbox Series S. I also added this cause decoration right here to the corner of the setup because I think it looked pretty dope. But enough of this talking, let's just get to the unboxing. Oh my goodness, I actually really like this design. It's just super simple. That is wild, that's so clean, bro. Pretty much done with the setup. The monitor and the Xbox have a power cable. If I were to connect it right here, I would need to run it under all the way over there to the outlet right there. So let me just, uh. There you go, much better. You got the backdrop down. I forgot to touch up on the mouse pad, by the way. And the glide is not too bad. For only $10, this is gonna get the job done. Some people have it laying down or some people have it standing up. I mean, personally, I like it standing up. It just looks way more cleaner. Overall, the setup is amazing. But now we're just gonna turn it on and I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to sign into my Microsoft account. And I think to turn it on, you just press on this button. So, oh, okay, the Xbox logo. Oh, hold up, hold up. So I'm gonna sign in real quick and I'll pick up the vlog in a bit. Fortnite is now downloading. I'm not too sure how I feel about this decor right here. I might move the plant and the cost figure. I might just put my Nike plant right there. It is almost done. It's about halfway downloading already. For the time being, I'm just gonna clean up around me because it is a mess. All right, guys, well. We got a problem. So Xbox only allows you to screen record up to 10 minutes and we tried to screen record for an hour using an external SSD card, but it said that the cord wasn't fast enough and we need to upgrade to a USB 3.0. So tomorrow we're gonna get a new cord. So which means we do have to postpone this. Man, I was so hyped too. Playing on the new setup. First time playing on the Xbox as well. So I'll pick up the vlog tomorrow. All right, good morning guys. It's the next day and me and my dad are gonna go pick up the cord from Target. We found the one that we needed. So let's head over there right now. Taking out the dogs right now, get some fresh air. All right guys, so someone just walked by us. Dogs are currently at the dog park. When someone passes by, they usually bark. So let's see if we can hear them. <laughs> we did. Guys, I got an announcement. I'm gonna be working on a new sim racing setup, so stay on the lookout. Thank you. What's <laughs> wrong? All right, quick pit stop. Came to get some halal, guys. Open sesame. I'm done eating, but before I start playing Fortnite, I gotta show you guys something. Okay, so first thing you wanna do, make sure you have 120 hertz on for that smooth gameplay and reduce the motion blur. Something else that's also super dope, you can watch some YouTube on here. So you go to Microsoft Edge, type in YouTube right here, and there you go, you're literally watching YouTube. You can also hire the quality. If you're doing your schoolwork or scripting, you can go on Google Docs. So let me show you how to do that real quick. 
I'm gonna create a new document. And there you go, typing whatever you want right here. You can still add the image, the table, the drawing, a chart, whatever you want to add here. And I'm just gonna put sub to Psy. And this is actually pretty clutch and also super dope. But not only can you watch YouTube and go to Google Docs, but you can watch movies right here also. And I'm just gonna put a uh, Creed right here. And there you go, you're watching Creed. You can also watch anime, which is so sick, bro. I'm just gonna put nine anime. Let's just put in Jujutsu Kaisen. And there you go, you're watching anime right here. And lastly, you can change the wallpaper. Oh, you go to settings and you go to personalization. Then you go down here and hit my background. In order to get the wallpaper onto the Xbox, you gotta add your wallpaper onto an external SSD. And make sure the wallpaper is 1920 on 1080p. So it should pop up right here. So you just go down and there you go. Hey, Loki, this is kind of hard. Enough of the talking. Let's just get into a game of Fortnite. Before we get into gaming Fortnite, I just want to let you guys know how much the setup was and what each thing costs. Starting with this keyboard right here, this is the Megagi, I'm not too sure if you pronounce it that way. The Megagi TS91 keyboard for about $20 on Amazon. This mouse right here is also from Amazon. This is the Coolmaster MM720 mouse for about $27. This mouse pad right here is about $10 on Amazon. Xbox, you can find this for as low as $269. And these headsets right here, these are the Black Shark V2 gaming headsets. Was only see sound amazing. You can buy these on Amazon for about $50. And lastly, this monitor right here we got from Micro Center for $99. And in total, my setup cost $400. $75, which is honestly not that bad. All right, let's see. I'm excited to see how this performs, bro. Let's go. After ups and downs with the Xbox and the setup, we're good to go. So let's see how this does. I started like... Okay, that was, I think that was a little frame drop right there because I kind of stuttered a little bit. Yo, that's wild. Let's go, bro. Get out my lobby. Stop spamming. Oh my goodness, there's someone right there. Bro, I just see this gun fall out, bro. That was actually kind of scary. Okay, got one. Tell me, bro. Can I walk? Ain't no way he got that. Ain't no way he got that, bro. There's no way I won that. There's no way I won that. There's actually no way I won that, bro. What the heck? Come on, let me take the dub. Let's go, baby. Let's go. All right, I'm going to um, play some regular at our Royale. Hey, but other than that, when I was playing box fights, there was a frame drop. But after that, nothing really happened, and it was pretty smooth. So now we're just gonna go into the game and see how and test it out since there are more people. So let's see. It's so cool. The medallions actually like help you, like either be giving a jump boost and healing. It's so dope, bro. All right, let's see. Okay, smooth. Yo, where's everyone at? Come on, bro. Okay, I really got no maps. I gotta go. I gotta play smart. Wait, hold up. Wait, am I in a bot lobby, bro? 29 people left in this zone? No, that is actually wild. A car! I see a car! Get out of my lobby, kid. Oh, there you go. Who got at me? Never mind. But I'll hit you with a snipe. Oh, oh, oh. All right, I think we're chilling now. I think we're chilling. There's someone up here. Please. Oh my goodness, he's up there. Okay. Oh my goodness, bro. Like, bro, bro just climbing up, bro. No. Come on. One shot. He's literally one shot. One bullet. Oh my goodness. Okay, I hear some gunshots. I hear some gunshots. He's out here. Come on, thank you, my goodness, bro. Ooh, I see there's a fight over there. Look at that, there's literally a fight going on over there. Did he just get eliminated by the final NPC? Let's go, baby. There you are. Nah, bro, definitely got jump scared. Oh my goodness. No, please don't, please no. I'm done. I'm done with the game. That's pretty much it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. And like I said, this setup was under $500 right here. So I hope I was able to inspire some of you guys to make a setup like this. But other than that, I love you guys so much. Make sure to like, subscribe, leave a comment down below. And I'll see you on the next one. Peace.
Let's hit myself, guys. Hey, you think I should put it right here? Put the Xbox on top of that. Why? I think it's gonna fall. You're good. You shouldn't be going really fast anyway. Oh, the Xbox is on for. GG's.